I don't want Roger Clemens in jail for steroids or perjury, just for wasting my time. This is why we should be able to arrest anyone at any time for any reason. And you have the right to remain yelling, Doc. Tell them what we're doing. Sometimes certain sports stories are so awful to talk about, they hasten our deaths. The best we can do is choose how it happens. This is pick your poison. Drink up, Kenny. It's either a chivalrous LeBron James draping his compression sleeve upon a cold-armed lady or Dale Earnhardt Jr. promising to repeat his just-ended streak of 143 consecutive NASCAR losses. I'm chugging Jr.'s antifreeze. His reign of losing may have come to an end. He's not done losing yet, Kenny. He's vowed to break his own record with 144 defeats. That kind of losing is unbeatable, even for June Bug. Now pick your poison. Will it be the Thunder fans from Game 2 remaining in the arena to wait for Game 6? Or the success of the Heat's new offense designed to have Mario Chalmers standing in everyone's way? I didn't listen to the first thing you said. I said this Chalmers clogged offense is great strategy by Spolstra. True, every great kitchen has an extra chef who stands around trying to sniff what's in the pots. But Chalmers isn't up to the task. I saw way too many unimpeded drives to the basket by LeBron. That was when James Jones. Jones was on the court. Then switch up that smug look on your face with a dying one and pick your poison. Will it be the lip-eating bacteria that the LA Kings caught from kissing the Stanley Cup or the new Nike Olympic tracksuits that sculpt the penis into a more aerodynamic shape? Peter Piper picked a peck of poison penis, Kenny, and I'm going the same route. These new suits are transforming the game, shaping the penis into a perfectly symmetrical fin that hugs the lower abdomen and lets runners slice through the air like penis face sharks. Doc, your words sicken me and the Greeks. The performance-limiting effect of a loose penis has always been an essential part of sports. Tuck it out of the equation, and you can throw out the record The Olympics books. were always meant to showcase the evolution of penis use in sports. The penis is supposed to fight back, Doc, and flop around like a trout. Now, before I gut and clean you, that's it for Pick Your Poison. But here's the antidote. A clip of me in a new documentary called All the King's Men, the 94-95 Sacramento Kings. You have got to understand every year, there are teams that have the potential to be perfectly mediocre, but no one has ever put it together like that Kings team. They were immaculately middle of the road. Check it out, Goop Fights. First part airs Sunday at 6 on OSN. I'm asleep, Kenny. Watching that made me fall asleep, and all my talking is snoring. You snore too articulately, I Doc. can't hear Nobody's you gonna over the sound you. of my snoring.